Hello and welcome back to another video on Unpack Technologies. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to change the icons of your files and folders on your macOS device. This will allow you to change what your files or folders look like on your Mac and the way that they present themselves with you being able to add custom images to these icons. So let's get straight into it. All right, so this is a pretty simple process, but it allows some additional customization that you may not have known was possible on Mac OS. So I've got a couple of things to demonstrate this to you uh, today. So what I'm gonna do is make a new folder, um, and this one's just gonna be called test. Um, and then I've also got a screenshot here that we're going to change, and I've also got the Mac OS Sonoma wallpaper um, that we were going to add to these icons. So. What we'll do is we'll start with the folder here and what you need to do is get your uh, get the image you want to replace the icon with uh, ready. So in this case I'm going to use the macOS Sonoma wallpaper as the image here just for demonstration purposes. So get it ready and either have it ready to drag in or click command C on it so you can copy it. So that's what I'm doing there. I've just copied the image and then it, on your folder um, or file which I'll show you in a moment, but I'll do it on the folder first. What you want to do is click on it and then click, do a uh, right click on the folder. And then what you want to do is go down to get info and then click that. Now what you can do in this little section here is if you uh, went command C to the file, you can click up here and then click command V. So I'll demonstrate that here. And then when you click command V, it then changes the icon in the preview uh, and the actual file itself. So once again, what I did there is go up to the little icon in the top left hand corner of the get info page. And then I essentially clicked it and went command V to add the file to it. Now, um, the other thing you can do is drag it into that area. So drag your file, drag it in and it will replace it like so as well. So I could do the same thing. If I want it to look like the screenshot, I can drag that in and you'll see it now replaces it to make it look like the screenshot. So I'll put it back to the Sonoma wallpaper here. And you can see that as I open it, it's still a normal file um, and folder that works just fine. But it just replaces the icon and it acts as a normal folder here. So that works quite well. And then the same thing applies for the screenshot here. So what I can do is click on it, right click, and then go to get info. And then what we can do is command C the image and then paste it or we can just drag it in all together and it will replace the image. So that works on any file or folder on your Mac. So um, the other thing you can do is if you want to get rid of it at any time, so I'll put this back in here. Um, and then if you decide, oh, I actually want to get rid of um, what is on the icon that I replaced it with, all you have to do is click up in the top left where you put the uh, replacement icon and then just click the delete button or the backspace key on your keyboard and it and then it will remove it. So I can do the same thing on the folder here. Go back to get info, click on it and then click delete and it goes back to its normal stylings for the default Mac OS. So yeah, that's a really simple and easy process on how to replace the folder icon on your mac os device this works for folders or files or even drives like on the uh, t7 shield here my external ssd i can go to get info and you'll see that i can also replace that icon if i would like to as well just like so and if i want to get rid of it i can click it and then click backspace or delete so yeah, hopefully this was helpful and you've had some great success in changing the icon of your file or folder on your macOS device. Hopefully it's allowed some additional customization on your Mac that you may not have been aware of and it's allowed you to really customize your Mac to the way it works best for you. And also, while we're on the topic of files on the desktop, considering these are on the desktop right now, I did make a video on how to organize your desktop 
on Mac OS. So if you'd like to see that, I'll leave that linked up in the cards and in the description below if you'd like to see that. If you have a really messy desktop, desktop like I do, then it's really worth checking that video out. It shows exactly how you can clean it up into a really nice, neat manner. Thanks for watching this video on Unpack Technologies. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next video.